Today I'll show you how to play a randomly selected audio file from Metasound and how to control, if we can say so, the randomness of your choice. Now let's start by creating a wave player and connect it to the audio output and the trigger on finished. Now to store the audio assets we need to create a array so we can create a new variable, we can rename it, so let's say array audio of type wave asset and then we check is array. Under default value we add uh, elements so the first one it's going to be the explosion and the second one this collapsing uh, sound effect. Now we can drag and drop our array inside the editor. We can drag out from it and connect it to a random get wave asset which is triggered on play and triggers the wave player. The value reference is connected to the wave player and now we can have a listen. Great, now what if we want to control the randomness? We can use the weight input array, but before doing so we need to create an array, a float array. So once again we uh, create a new variable, we can rename it uh, weights array of type float and we check for is array. From here you need to add as many elements as the audio files contained in the audio array. So I'm going to add two elements and the value here inside this number box uh, is a percentage. You should think of it as a percentage normalized between 0 and 1. If we say that here the percentage is 0, we'll never hear the audio file at index 0 which is the explosion. Now let's try to do it. So we uh, distribute the weights all to the second audio file. We can connect the array to the weights input and have a listen. Hopefully this video was helpful for you. If so, I invite you to give a like and subscribe to the channel. As always, thank you for watching and I'll catch you in the next one.